Ladies and gentlemen, I'm talking to one of the four superstars who will be competing in a fatal four-way match at No Way Out for the right to challenge the World Heavyweight Champion at WrestleMania. And tonight, all four contenders will be in the ring in tag team action. You will be facing Matt Hardy and Bobby Lashley, and your partner will be... Leave me alone. I mean it, Randy. I don't want anything to do with you. Jillian, you get your ass back here right now. Don't you run away from me. What are you jerks looking at? Why don't you mind your own damn business? Your partner will be Randy Orton. Well, we've reached the main event tonight on SmackDown, and here comes a man I suppose you could say we heard from earlier tonight. Cole, I gotta ask you, what the heck was all that about before? Jillian Hall looked like she was running away from Randy Orton. Orton looking like he was going to blow a gasket. What gives? I have no earthly idea, Taz. I'd say you saw what I saw. Yeah, but I was out here working for a living, and you were right there. Didn't you used to be like a journalist or something like that? And all you can say is, I have no earthly idea? I'll tell you what, that's some crackerjack reporting right there. Oh, God. Listen to that crowd. This is Michael Cole with Taz at ringside, bringing you SmackDown action from Seattle, Washington. They're already going crazy, and the action hasn't even started yet. You know tonight's show, Cole, is going to be off the hook. No question. The SmackDown superstars never fail to bring the house down, and Seattle will never be the same after tonight. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest. He's going for the submission. And he might get it. He's got the hook locked in. No, no, no disrespect. <laughs> but when is Matt Hardy just going to pass it in the call of the day? I don't think you're ever going to see that from Matt Hardy, Taz. He said it himself. He will not die. Cole, I'd ask you who you were pulling for in this match, but I think it's pretty obvious since the beginning who you're rooting for. Never play to be completely objective, Taz. There's a dude with guts. These top rope moves are risky. Dodge that bullet. Man, this match is so good. It's even worth sitting next to you to watch it, Cole. Well, thanks a lot, Taz. You know, you're not always my number one choice for a broadcast partner either. You know what you should do, girl pants? You should team up with Jim. He knows his opponent is completely helpless to resist the submission hold. And that means you gotta either dig deep and find a way to break it, or you gotta just flat out tap out. He wasted no time going for that pin. Oh boy, looks like someone's moving up in the world. What? I don't know, Paul. I'm kind of unsure about Randy Orton. But he's a pretty boy, let's face it. He's accomplished a couple of big things, but I still think that he's about 90% height. A couple of big things? You mean like becoming the youngest world heavyweight champion in history? Making a career of killing legends? Having one of the longest intercontinental title reigns of the last decade? Look, that all sounds fine and well. Real impressive on paper. But Evolution was backing him up on half of that stuff. And remember, all that happened on war. It didn't happen here on SmackDown. We got a little bit of a different level of competition. You know what I'm saying. I don't entirely disagree with that, Taz, but I still think you're selling Orton short. There's no question in my mind that he's one of the most exciting young superstars in all of sports entertainment. Yeah, well, you know what? I still think Randy Orton's just a cocky punk who's going to get his sooner than later. And it might happen right here tonight. Oh, man, there's the tag. There's not a superstar in the locker room who can afford to ignore these fans, Cole. You're right about that. 